Hey everyone, it's Mark from Kings Lane Sport Fishing. I'm down at the boat today uh, doing some maintenance and uh, recording a few videos. And uh, one question I often get asked is how do I store my rigs? So here I got a flasher with a fly on the end. And uh, you know, some guys will take it and just wrap it around. The problem with doing this is it really uh, it kinks your line. So here's a tip that I use. Basically, uh, I go to the dollar store and I pick up a pool noodle, you know, for like a buck fifty, two bucks. And what I do is I take a knife and I basically cut a little piece of the pool noodle. And I take the pool noodle, I put a slit in it, and then basically from there, I take my flasher, take my pool noodle, put that around. And what I do then is I just wrap the leader around the pool noodle. And then take the hooks and put it in the foam. And now I got a great way to store my rigs. Super quick, super easy, super cheap, and uh, great way to store all your all your various rigs, whether it be flies, or in this case, I got a kingfisher with a meat rig. What I do in the kingfishers, I usually use two pieces, and uh, it works really really well. And then when I store these, all I do is I have a, a clear bin that I picked up at Walmart for like 10, 15 bucks, big bin. I just drop all the rigs in, and they're ready to go. That way, when I'm on the boat. If I get a break off or I need to change rigs, super quick, take it, unravel the rig, no kinks, clip it on my line and ready to fish. So hope this tip is useful for you. Super cheap, super effective, you know, dollar fifty, two bucks. Get a big huge pool noodle. You can probably do about twenty rigs with one pool noodle. So uh, give it a try. Super simple, and uh, you know what? Uh, stop uh, those kinks in your fishing line. Hope this helps. Good luck on the water this year, and if you do like the video. Please don't forget to click on the subscribe button and that like button. It helps me a great deal as an amateur YouTube content provider. Good luck. Talk to you later.